I just finished that book. And, um, The Gathering by Kelly Armstrong. And we'll see that bad. Columbia on um, British Islands and like this. I don't know. Let's read it. It was really good. Now I'm on to this book. Midnight Embrace by Ash Amanda Ashley. I'm not I'm gonna finish it, but I'm not sure I'm gonna keep it. her room because she has to paint the other wall and before that I was taking a nap before that I was up with my grandmother because in September I'm going to a wedding so she got me dressed wedding and this is it it just goes just past my knee and it's kind of ruffled here it's an interesting kind of ruffled It's a little ruffled, it's just past my knee, and it's a strapless one. And this, it's not the greatest, but it's like this really, really nice purple. On here, to me it looks more blue than purple, but it's purple. It's a gorgeous purple. My grandmother also got me the shoes for it. In a gray box. And this company also made my dress. So that's pretty awesome. It's already so funky in the box. And here it is. There's, this is like a rose, black rose flower design. Poof there. It's all straps. That's pretty cool. And yeah, that's the big. It looks. They're like my other sandals that I've worn. My other strap ones. And the heat, but the heel is a lot bigger. This is uh, like basically stiletto. Get back in the box. I'm happy about those shoes. Uh, she also bought me another pair of shoes, which I have no idea why, but she did. Yeah, you could probably already tell by the brand that they're going to be more comfortable shoes, but they're cool. There are their wedges, and sandals, and these kind of just strap up around my ankle. Just um, like buckle at the back. And they wrap around like this. Yeah. They're mm, like the ones that I cut up. I like the strap was in the back and it was Oh boy, my camera stopped again. Anyway. They um just I sorry, you're gonna do in my face. It's awesome comfy shoes. Amazing dress shoes. An amazing dress. She also got me a new bra and panties. <laughs> and you're not gonna get to see it. But it's um but it's like the same kind of purpley shade as the top of the dress. And um, the straps are funky, so it's like, I don't, yeah. They're just, they're epic. Everything she bought today was epic. And she bought me lunch, which she didn't have to. And she didn't have to get me the under things either, but I 
<laughs> she's an awesome grandma. Yeah. Hey, yeah, the wedding's not happening until September, but the wedding shower is on the 22nd, and I have to be all pretty. It's the wedding's for um my second cousin, but I just consider her my my like my cousin Josh and Jake and Ross. And their mothers would be my aunt's technically, her mother would be my aunt technically, but I would actually be my first cousins, but I just call them aunts. So, yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah. This book I'm reading, Amanda Ash, Midnight Embrace by Amanda Ashley. She is also, well, she is actually called Madeline Baker. Or Madeline, whatever, how you want, however you want to pronounce it, but her last name is Baker, and she writes ro Indian romance, like, uh, Native American Aboriginal, yes, Aboriginal romance novels, that's where you go, so yeah, and then she took her hand at writing vampire novels, <laughs> that's the only Amanda Ashley one that I have, and I'm not exactly liking it, but I'm going to finish it, so that I can say I did read it, and I can say I didn't like it, and then get rid of it. And then there's one off my book list. What? So then I'm down to 590. And I, ha I actually have two of um, her Aboriginal books. Let's t <laughs> I'm not hope let's just hope that um, her Aboriginal books are better and more pulling in read than her vampire book that I read. I haven't read any of her other stuff, like Amanda Ashley stuff. So it would be unfair, but yeah, I didn't like that. I don't really like that book. Yeah. And I'm almost finished. I just have those three. I also have on calling on hold. I probably already told you this, but it's on hold. It's going to be a while, so that's why I'm reading Midnight and Brace right now. And, um, I'm not going to read this, this one. Because it's kind of in the middle of the series. So, and I want, I've already read one of the books. I just can't remember. Don't look at my chest. I don't remember which one I read before, but I know I read one of them. And I'm like, oh my god, I really like this 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 series. I've never heard of that all there, but like my grandmother had one of the books, and I was like, hey, what's this author? What's this book again? And she can't remember. Anyway, uh, that book I own, so that way it's all good. And uh, yeah. Uh, I really gotta vacuum. I really gotta do stuff, but and I really gotta get you guys up in my YouTube. Sorry if my face is a little good. I have napped. <sighs> As I said. While I'm in the middle of watching Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, Special Extended Edition. Yes, that was a long title. <coughs> I, I'm still the big night work. I'm sorry, I'm choking on spit and water. They, um, the hops and black riders are involved. I thought of two new book ideas. One's a fanfic about, I guess, me as a hobbit. But that's as much as I'm gonna give you until another, until next time. I remember. And the other one is, um, like an actual novel I would get published called Bloody Nine. And that's also all I'm gonna tell you. Cause I don't want someone stealing my book idea. But it's pretty good. I actually have three ti It's gonna be a series. And I have three titles already. 
I don't know how long the series, but yeah, I've got three of them ready. So. <sighs>